Hi, welcome back to this little mini-series on circle theorems. So our aim is to prove all of the circle theorems, of which there are, well, five main ones, and that's the ones I'm going to prove. So if you haven't seen the first one, we lay out a lot of the fundamental ideas, mainly to do with circles, and a lot of the ideas we're going to use to prove this circle theorem are similar to the way in which we proved the first circle theorem. Now, if you don't remember what that was, it basically said that the angle at the center is twice that of the angle at the circumference. Okay, so let's take a look at this one and prove it. So what does it say? The angle opposite the diameter is 90. So here we have our diameter, AC. So I'll write that down. So AC is the diameter, or as it says in the question, AOC, that's fine. And the angle opposite the diameter is 90. So what it's saying is that this angle here is 90 degrees. So let's go ahead and prove this. As I said, we're going to use some similar techniques to what we did to prove the first one. Now, let's draw a radius O to B. So, and let's just write that down. So O to B is a radius, but also O to A and O to C are radius. O to A, O to C. So radii is the plural of radius, so that's where that comes from. So that basically means that this distance here is R, so is this one, and so is this one. And again, what, we, what have we got here? We've got two isosceles triangles, so namely AOB and BOC. So I'll write that down as well. So A, O, B, B, O, C are isosceles. And what does this mean? Well, it means the two base angles are equal. So if you struggle with your isosceles triangles, then go and do some revision on that, because you need to know about isosceles. So that means that these two angles are equal. Let's call them X. And indeed, these two base angles are also equal in our other triangle. Let's call them y. So essentially, what we're trying to prove now is that x plus y equals 90. So trying to prove x plus y equals 90. Okay, so where can we go from here? Well, just as we did in proving circle theorem 1, we found the other two angles in our triangles, namely these two here. So again, similar argument. This angle is 180 minus 2x because, and this is the symbol for because, because x plus x plus 180 minus 2x equals 180. Or in other words, angles in a triangle add to 180. Okay, so this angle here is 180 take away 2x. And of course, that means that this angle here is 180 take away 2y, because y plus y plus 180 minus 2y is 180. Okay, where can we go next? Well, we know that AOC is a diameter, which means it's a straight line. In particular, any angles that are formed on this line must add up to 180. So let's th write that down here. So angles on a straight line add to 180. So this tells us that our two angles here, this one and this one, must add up to 180. So 180 minus 2x plus 180 minus 2y equals 180. Okay, and we can of course simplify this so we get 360 um, minus 180 equals 2x plus 2y. So 2x plus 2y equals 180. And now hopefully you can see that we can divide by 2. So this tells us that x plus y equals 180 divided by 2, which is 90. And if you recall, this is what we were trying to prove up here. So we're done. We have proved that this angle up the top is 90 degrees. Hope you've enjoyed. Any questions do let me know. 
Stay tuned for the next Circle Theorem Proof. Bye-bye.